the Lagos State Government has begun its annual promotion exercise. For those in the teaching service, the exercise started with a structural training where about 5,000 eligible officers were sensitized on the themes agenda of the Babajide Sonwolu administration. The Chairman, Teaching Service Commission, Mrs. Olabisi Ariyo said the training is compulsory and any officer who fails to participate will not be promoted. This year we are feeding almost 5,000 candidates for promotion, for collective officer for promotion. And uh, you can see from what is going on that they are receptive and uh, they are learning new things. We are bringing them up to date on their professional uh, areas and uh, we are even bringing them up today on the team's agenda. It's not this exam that we've been doing before. Okay. We want to test them, we want to see the way they respond to information, new ideas and so on and so forth. It is mandatory for them to attend this. As a commission member, I want to say the Lagos State Government is trying in making sure that all eligible um, uh, candidates for this year's promotion are given the opportunity to do that and that is exactly what we're doing now. Some of the eligible officers shared their views on the training, describing the program as impactful. It's not strange to me. It has been the normal routine of the Lagos State Government to train and retrain teachers, staffs, all the people that work with them, they go, they take them out for training. This is not the first training I've come for under the government of Lagos State. I've been trained and I've retrained others too. So we give kudos to the governor, to the government of Lagos State. It's going to be impactful to everybody, not to me alone. All of us that are present here, we are going to benefit one way or the other from there. Most of, I work in the office and I know and I know that what I have gained today, I'm going back to the office to make best use of it. Here we've been told, we've been taught on how to make best use of all the things that we are giving to us by the schedule of job given to us in the office, how we can make best use of it to bring out the useful result. That's the goal of, that is desired, that is, request, that is required for everybody in the office. More so in the classroom too, because we have teachers here too that are undergoing the same training. So the teachers too will go back to the school to know how to manage the students. After the structural training, the eligible officers are expected to go through an oral interview and successful candidates will be promoted. The structural training program replaced the written examination aspect of staff appraisal, thereby ensuring merit and objectivity in staff assessment and promotion.